main reasons why patients present with really old tears. I am Dr. Steve Mora. I take care of very old pec major tears. These are the reasons that I've heard from my patients who've traveled from all over the country, if not the world, to see me with their old tear. First of all, they thought that the tear wasn't that bad, felt the pop, the swelling and bruising went down, didn't think it was a big deal because they become painless. Over time, the deformity develops, they present late. Another reason, the patient is injured, they present in a timely manner to their surgeon, the MRI is performed, and the MRI report states, myotendinous tear. Those words are the words that lead to so many patients not having surgery. Myotendinous tears, they can be repaired. E even if they're in the muscle, they still can be repaired. Just require a allograft. That's another reason. Another reason has to do with the MRI. The MRI is done at the shoulder the MRI and the tear is completely missed. They actually did have a tear because the MRI that was performed was too high. So it's actually a misdiagnosis. And, and the last reason is once again, the MRI report says partial tear, but guess what? They're partial, but it's a significant partial. So those are the main reasons why patients have ended up not having surgery in a timely manner. But, but this is the good news for no matter what the reason was, you have a deformity that's unsightly and you're not happy with it, it can be reconstructed. So there is hope. You guys have a great day. Let me know if I can help. Thanks.